India successfully test fires homegrown subsonic cruise missile near Bali. Balasur, Odisha, India on Tuesday successfully test fired its first indigenously designed and developed long range subsonic cruise missile near Bali, which has 1,000 km operational range and a capacity to carry warheads of up to 300 kg. It was successfully test fired from the Integrated Test Range ITR, at Chandipur along the Odisha coast. This was the fifth experimental test of the homegrown missile system. Out of the four earlier trials since its maiden launch in 2013, only one was successful. Describing the trial a success, a defense statement said the Defense Research and Development Organization DRDO, achieved yet another feat, the successful test flight of nearby which can be deployed from multiple platforms. Today's flight test achieved all the mission objectives completely, from lift-off till the final splash, boosting the confidence of all scientists associated with the trial, the statement said. Defense Minister Nirmala Sitarman complimented DRDO scientists for this inspired achievement. She was optimistic that this would take India to the select League of Nations possessing this complex technology and subsonic cruise missile capability, it said. Chairman of DRDO and Secretary Department of Defense, R&D, Drive S. Christopher, DG, Aero, Dr. C. P. Ramanarayanan, along with other senior DRDO scientists and user representatives from the Army witnessed the launch and congratulated the nearby team for making the DRDO proud. The state-of-the-art sleek cruise missile took off from a specially designed launcher from the Launch Complex 3 of the Integrated Test Range ITR, at Chandipur near Balasur. The missile has the capability to loiter and cruise at 0.7 Mach, at altitude as low as 100 m. It took off in a programmed manner and all critical operations like launch phase, booster deployment, engine start, wing deployment and other operational parameters demonstrated through autonomous waypoint navigation, the statement said. The guidance, control, and navigation system of the missile is configured around the indigenously designed ring laser gyroscope, RLG, and MEMS-based inertial navigation system, INS, along with GPS system, it said. The missile cruised for 50 minutes, achieving the range of 647 kilometers. It was tracked with the help of ground-based radars and other parameters were monitored by indigenous telemetry stations developed by the DRDO, the statement said. According to a DRDO scientist associated with the project, powered by a solid rocket motor booster developed by the Advanced Systems Laboratory ASL, the nearby missile has an operational range of 1,000 km. It can travel with a turbofan or turbojet engine and is guided by a highly advanced inertial navigation system indigenously developed by the research center Imara, RCI, he said. After the missile achieves designated altitude and velocity, the booster motor is separated and the engine automatically switches on for further propulsion, the scientist said. He said, midway in its flight, the missile's wing opens up by the commands generated by the sophisticated onboard computer for stabilizing the flight path. The health parameters of the vehicle were monitored at indigenous telemetry stations by a team of professionals from DRDO's ITR and LRDE, Electronics and Radar Development Establishment. The two-stage missile is 6 meter long, 0.52 meter wide with a wingspan of 2.7 meter. It can carry a warhead of 200 kg to 300 kg at a speed of 0.6 to 0.7 Mach. Its launch weight is about 1,500 kg, DRDO sources said. The maiden test flight of nearby, on March 12, 2013, had to be terminated midway for safety reasons as a component malfunctioned. However, the second launch on October 17, 2014 was successful. In the next trial on October 16, 2015, the missile deviated from its path after covering 128 kilometers. The last test flight on December 21 last year had to be aborted after 700 seconds of the missile's test flight as it deviated from its designated path. All these trials were conducted from the same base at Chandipur ITR.